All right, so this is probably super dumb and dangerous. Yeah, they're still good. At least this box is good. Yeah, that's fine. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. That's probably a good kick for real. Like, they're super slimy. My hands stink, man. Like, they... Huh. What is going on, people? So we got a little adventure for you today. I'm actually backing in. We're at a fish farm right now. So, y'all may have heard, we've got, we've got a lot of grass going on in the pond. So, me and Chris, Chris is guiding me in right now, we're backing up. There's Chris. We're picking up these fish, we're picking up grass carp, guys. That's what we're picking up. So we've got several grass carp we're gonna pick up here. Hey, how are you? Do you mind, we just, you've already got them boxed up, right? Okay, perfect. All right, so pre-packaged grass carp. We got five each in a bag right there. All right, so this is probably super dumb and dangerous, but yeah. we're gonna... Yeah, Chris, Chris doesn't like my driving to begin with. And now I'm gonna drive and hold a camera for a second. So we've got 10 grass carp. This is gonna be a super short video if you haven't already figured out. We got 10, what are you doing? What was, carp. Oh, oh, I got you. But we were told by the lady, we don't even have to temper them. They can just go straight in the pond. So this should be like super easy to get them in there. So we're gonna try to get our grass problem under control. Uh, 10 grass carp. Do you have any thoughts on this? You weren't really too keen on the grass carp. I don't think we need them. You don't I think, think we need I don't think there's that much grass. There's a lot of grass. There's a lot more grass than we had in it like in the last two years. Again, this is on the low end. Recommended, just if you're curious, uh, five to 10 grass carp per acre. Uh, the pond is two and a quarter acres. Y'all ask that a lot. So it's two and a quarter acre pond and we're putting 10 fish in. So we're at the very bottom of what it needs because we don't want to get rid of all the grass. We want there to be grass. That's what keeps the water clear. It's what keeps the, the bottom put together so it doesn't get muddy with all those fish in there. Uh, I do want to get it under control because with too much grass, you can't fish at all. So that's, that's my take. Anyway, all right, we're gonna wrap this up, get y'all back to the pond. Again, this is gonna be a super short one. So y'all hang tight. We're gonna see you when you get to the pond. All right, folks. We are at the pond. The fish, we hope, made it for all my driving. Yeah, they're still good. At least this box is good. Huh? Oh, I see it, it's upside down. We did lose one. Yeah. That stinks. That's $10 gone. What do you want to see? You and the fish. I don't care, me, I guess. I don't know what I want to see. How long have we been doing YouTube? Hey, they're not small. She said they were bigger than they thought they were big. Like they're not gonna like spine me or nothing. They don't have those things, do they? I've never picked up a carp either. This is all new experience. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. Huh? I'm okay, okay, that's fine. I don't know what the hell I'm doing, so that's probably a good kick one out. Are we filming? We're live. Oh, I don't okay. I'm kinda concerned with the aggressiveness. Okay, they're pretty aggressive. They're they're a little aggressive. Let's suck right onto your fingers. They're, they're slimy, dude. They're for real, like, they're super slimy. Gosh. I had him for a second. Oh, gosh. So there you go, there's one. I think I'm gonna dump the bag on these next ones. He's he's longer than half the bass in here. Water, you had cold water. This is really warm water. You got a scar on his head. I see. Ooh, my hands are like super slimy. There he goes. Look, there's tons of grass for you to eat. Let me see if I can get this big one out of here. If I can see him. I can't go touch the fish in your life. I got you, homie. <laughs> All right, last one, and then I'm just dumping them because they're too hard to just grab individually. Super slimy guys, too. He was ready to go. Go eat grass. He just don't look like he's got his faculties together. You see him? I'm gonna say you're probably not gonna make it. Look at his fins and stuff.
Well, those four were ready to go. Yeah, he don't look so good. All right, well, that's that's it. That's all we're gonna do for today. Like, this was a short one. Super, super short. Chris, how do you, my hands stink, man. Like, they, oh, that smell bad. Like, I like the smell of bass on my hands. Like, that means I had a good day. This is, this is a whole different situation we got. Anyway, like I said, I appreciate y'all coming and hanging out on this short little video. Uh, just putting some carp in the pond. We'd never had carp in the pond before. We've got nine. We had 10, we lost one on the drive apparently, or he was already sick when I have a feeling he was sick before we got him. And uh, we will see how it turns out. So hopefully they will uh, start managing the grass. And normally it takes them about a year, year and a half to really start doing their thing on the grass. Uh, my big thing is I don't want all this grass to die off and uh, there not be enough oxygen in the water when it starts decomposing, we have the pond turnover. I know Chris doesn't think that's a real possibility, but that is legit a possibility. Too legit to quit. It is, well, you're too legit to quit. Anyway guys, if you enjoyed the video, as always, hit that thumbs up. Leave a comment below on, did we do the right move here, putting some grass carp in here? Just having a few to manage a little bit of our grass population. Um, I don't think it's gonna hurt anything. All it can do is help at this point. And, as always, hit that red subscribe button. Turn it from red to gray so you'll be notified anytime we drop a new video. And uh, you can watch our crappy videos right from your home on YouTube and whatnot. What do you think of that, Chris? You guys have a good one. We'll catch you on the next one. <laughs>